नमस्कार आई एम डॉक्टर डी आर पटनायक इंडिया मेडिकल डिपार्टमेंट न्यू दिल्ली टुडे आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द वेदर कंडीशन दैट प्रिवेल ओवर इंडिया ड्यूरिंग लास्ट वीक एंड व्हाट वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग ड्यूरिंग द सब्सिक्वेंट टू वीक्स सो इफ यू सी टुडे ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ जुलाई तो लास्ट वीक वॉज वेरी एक्टिव मानसून कंडीशन प्रिवेल ओवर different part of india mainly the central and southern part of india associated with fast depression of the season and if we see the last week what are the synoptic condition prevail you can see the charts here and the a low pressure area was formed basically the low pressure area that is the rain bearing system that concentrated into a depression that is the fast depression of the monsoon season then also the monsoon trough at the sea level was very active and tilting southward with the high so that is a very sign of very good monsoon condition and the offshore trough was very active here the offshore trough was very active so that also give very good rainfall over the west coast of india and south peninsula of india and also the east west shear line that is whenever the monsoon trough shifting southward with height we get out the this type of shear line at middle troposphere level so all the four conditions that was very active monsoon condition that prevail during the last week that is from the 18 to 24th july and associated with this very active monsoon condition we got very good rainfall activity there are mainly three zones you can see very very heavy heavy and exceptionally heavy rainfall over along the west coast many sub regions that uh, uh, coastal karnataka konkan goa and also madhya maharashtra then also the uh, one pocket of very heavy rainfall extremely heavy rainfall over the the south gujarat region and associated with monsoon depression this is the belt central east central part of the india so this is the main rainfall belt that we have get although other part also got rainfall but this is highest rainfall over these three regions and if you see the so this is a track short lived track of the monsoon depression this is the fast monsoon depression of the season that is formed on 18 and now a contain into depression and then on 19 and then it began again enter into orissa and it left mark on 23 so associated with the, the system that the synoptic systems you can see how the rainfall we receive over different parts of india during the week and this is the graphical representation of day to day rainfall from 18 july to 24th july and where we got the very heavy and extremely heavy rainfall very heavy rainfall you can see it is just uh, uh, about 12 cm to 20 cm in a day and extremely heavy it is more than 20 cm rainfall so you can see the pockets of rainfall over the east central part of india then also madhya maharashtra coastal uh, karnataka then coastal then gujarat region so here we got the mainly the more rainfall also some pockets of the northern india also we have got a good rainfall and if you see the quantitatively you can see very exceptionally heavy rainfall you can see the on a day to day basis some of the rainfall that we have highest rainfall that received during the week that we have noted so on 18 july coastal karnataka that coastal rock received 24 cm mainly the 19 july if you see the poor bandar received 49 cm this is a very significant amount of rainfall actually one day rainfall 49 cm it is quite high and also the other part even that is on 20th july also saurashtra ko dwarka that got 42 cm so like this all this part central india part and west coast and along the south peninsula so these are the belt where we got very exceptional heavy rainfall during the week and today that is on 25th rainfall 25th july that is also got very good rainfall uh, uh, different parts of the country and you can see how the graphical yes that is the thing very active and madhya maharashtra this is tam in hini that is 56 cm that means further increase from the previous week highest rainfall and also the gujarat region konkan goa east madhya pradesh pradesh so all these regions have got very exceptional heavy rainfall 56 cm 35 cm 28 cm 33 cm and also some of the uh, other station also got about 20 cm or slightly less so this is a major that's that's why as i was telling this is a very active week prevailed during last week and today also we got very active rainfall over most part of india
and associated with this active rainfall at this week has changed actually the seasonal figure of rainfall if you see the left panel of rainfall that is the how the rainfall recorded over the uh, different subdivisions of india during the last week that is from 18 to 24 july if you see this is the rainfall and actual rainfall 80.5 this is for a country as a whole and the normally 57.2 so that's why the departure is 41 percent that is 41 percent above normal received during the week that is quite high rainfall actually and, and associated with this if you see the all this dark blue color that is the rainfall departure large excess 60 percent or more so this because of the heavy rainfall actively heavy rainfall over these regions that week is very MS, good week with respect to monsoon rainfall and if you see here the central india and south peninsula has got 100 central india 110 7 percent that is very high amount of rainfall uh, in a particular week over the central part of india and uh, also the south peninsula that south peninsula that is 97 percent so here these two are very good rainfall although other part means northwest and east and east northeast that you can see red pockets are there also and green pockets so that's why that is a negative rainfall so deficient rainfall that means it is a very contrasting northwest and east northeast is less rainfall whereas central and south peninsula has got very good rainfall and due to this weekly good rainfall activity how the seasonal rainfall seasonal rainfall means from the monsoon season beginning from 1st june to till now that 24th of july if you see look at this figure this is the seasonal pattern but this week has contributed a significantly to this season as a result the now the all india country as a whole it is now one percent above normal above normal it has just uh, previously it was minus three percent last week ending on 17th of july it was minus three percent and now it is uh, plus one percent so and uh, also if you see this packet is here it is normal or above normal is that is the central india or south peninsula slightly above normal whereas still northwest and your east northeast till it is on the negative side of the normal this is the seasonal rainfall from first june and uh, on day to day basis if you see the time series of the rainfall this is the for the country as a whole and this is the red line is your normal line and this is the day on which it is uh, rainfall is whether it is more than normal or less than normal so if you see this is the till 25th of july here in this case and uh, this is the over the four homogeneous region so as i said four homogeneous region the central india uh, many days it is above normal then red line vertical lines are uh, crossing the uh, red line so above normal rainfall similarly south peninsula also many days you will get their good rainfall activity but whereas your northwest india if you see this is the less rainfall zone and also initially it was less rainfall and even the east northeast also if you see this is the less rainfall rainfall zone that's why it is still negative and uh, other two regions are positive now the today condition today condition synoptic conditions after this monsoon depression now still the monsoon is uh, means there is no major system the depression is not there or low pressure is not there but the cyclone circulation is there monsoon trough is close to normal position means uh, or slightly south of normal we have west coast trough and also uh, this monsoon trough if you see it is passing through the normal line and and west coast trough so this this is just a, a miss slightly uh, not very active condition but still it is better better condition and if you see the associated with this synoptic system this synoptic system what we are expecting during the next week so if you see the our model that uh, we are running global model so this is the forecast from the global forecast system model 12 km resolution if you see that this is the wind and the setting is your rainfall so yes we are expecting the rainfall over this part and also here this part during next uh, as well as the cyclone circulation and also another circulation is also likely to form around the first of august also so this this is the how the rainfall distribution is expected from the model and we also run the couple model that is for extended range forecast just to have guidance about the next two weeks what we are expecting the whether it is uh, will be less than normal or whether it will be slightly more than normal so in this case that this is the week one and that is uh, from 25 july to 1 august and that is uh, second week is from 1 to 8 august so if you see this is the rainfall and this is the departure departure means whether it will be above normal or below normal wherever this is positive setting is there 
rainfall is expected to be higher than normal. So still we are expecting a good rainfall week during next one week and also the next two weeks. So that means the next uh, two weeks uh, mean rainfall is expected to be slightly normal or to uh, above normal mainly over the central and also some part of northwest India. So that 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 is the model guidance that uh, is giving about the expected rainfall during the next week. And due to the, the model guidance what we have got, the, we have given very miss warning and uh, disaster managers should take appropriate action and particularly for next 5 days warning, this is the day one, today 25th July day 1 forecast warning and this is the day 2 and this is the day 3. So here if you see the major red color warning I here that is over. <coughs> Konkan and Goa, Madhya Maharashtra during next two days and Gujarat region. So that's why this is the thing the two next two days are very crucial over that region and subsequently there is slightly improvement in the uh, rainfall condition. That means improvement in the sense we have the red color runnings are not there so for next uh, after uh, two days. So this is the thing and day four and day five there is also improvement only over this uh, um, Madhya Maharashtra and Konkan Goa region. So here, so that means monsoon rainfall is slightly expected to decrease over the region after three days. And associated with this rainfall, we say we have to give the damage expected and the, uh, what are the actions should be taken because a lot of rainfalls are there, water logging will be there and uh, traffic congestion will be there. So uh, advisories are being issued and uh, all the, the what are the precaution and damage expected are given. So the disaster managers are regularly issuing this type of uh, advisory for public to take the appropriate action. And uh, this is uh, also the cyclonic forecast uh, whether uh, we are expecting any genesis of the depression or cyclone during the next two weeks. So as, uh, as, as per the model guidance it is not indicating any genesis of the system during next two weeks and uh, however there will be cyclonic circulation during the first week also and also the beginning of the second week. This cyclonic circulation that, is, that will fall over the Bay of Bengal will also move northwestward and it will give some rainfall distribution. However, we are not expecting the system to intensify into a low pressure area or depression during the next two weeks. So this is the, all our social application uh, apps and um, mobile apps and website, Facebook, etc. Through which we can get all the detail of the warnings and our advisory and uh, other th city forecast. So all applications are available. So you can uh, download this thing and you get your city forecast or your wherever the forecast is required for your location. So with this, uh, I I conclude this weekly this map discussion. And again, we'll be coming back with the next uh, next week. Again, we'll have uh, another map discussion with covering the the past weather conditions and also the expected weather condition during the subsequent two weeks. Thank you. Namaskar.